Look, whenever I'm developing something new, I tend to take a look at what already exists, study how it's being implemented and what it can do, what problems they've had over time when they've been developing it. Look, you need to look at all this information, read their documentation, especially look at the problems and issues they've had to work around over time. Okay, now, here is a video I just recorded of another issue on macOS Catalina, and actually I had it in previous versions too, so not necessarily Catalina, but what's happened is I was using a quick time to record the screen, and then when we get to about here, see the video just freezes? Um, it's So basically the there's no video after here, but there is audio, and then the parts previous to it we do. So if I you better see this. If I go into like, just press preview or hit space, you'll see that, let's just pause that. And let's hit the adjustment thing here. So if I bring this back, what you'll see is it'll just go gray right around about where the video got stuck. So the video got stuck around about here. So let's pull this out. Okay, so what we'll do is I'll try and save the video. It's around 44 seconds. Like here, is that's where I, kind of where I want the video to crop because the rest of it's all just stuck, so it doesn't make sense what I'm saying. Um, let's hit done, and we'll save it as untitled on the desktop. So new clip, um, just save it as untitled, and it will fail. It won't be able to, yeah, it won't be able to save it. And if we just open this one back up again, you'll see how it's just all gray at the end after the point where it's just frozen. So unless I pull this out, we don't actually have any any video there. There's the recording got stuck um, around about here. And if I cut, just uh, close anyway. If I open this in QuickTime and try to do the same thing, I believe they got the same implementation. Um, 44 seconds is where I want it to be, right there file um, split clip okay so it'll play here but if I delete that and then hit done and close so I'll save it as untitled to the desktop it also will fail now you guys blame the the huge huge usage of kernel task on FFmpeg but look it's been around for a long time and it's implemented in hundreds and hundreds of video encoding projects and especially big ones like Plex Media Server, a lot of media servers um, like uh, Squeeze I think they call it um, that's a big popular one uh, Adobe's I don't know if they still use it but they used to in their uh, rendering um, and yeah it, it's, it's, a, it's implemented in a lot now it'll have the resilience to do what I'm trying to do oh, I need this at the time so I want to stop the clip at um, T0044. Uh, uh, I want to stop the clip at 44 seconds. Um, so let's render this out to the desktop. Oops, I um, forgot to put quotation marks around my input. And I forgot what the key combination is to go to beginning. Um, bear with me for a sec, hold on. So, FFmpeg will have the resilience to fix issues like this. And this is why you, you need to be looking at what problems they've overcome in the past so that you don't run into these issues as well, or you can work around them when you're building these apps for yourself. Please be quick. I haven't put all my settings back in yet because I was trying to limit the number of settings after doing the reinstall so that way if someone else needs to reproduce the issue on their end, they don't have to change some of the settings. 
I noted every settings here and settings changed. Um, users, CPT, desktop, there we go. Oh, okay, allow. Uh, sorry, I missed the um, the time. It actually come up pretty quickly. Uh, but yeah, you can see it's finished rendering. Didn't have any problems. Um, here's the output here. If I make this smaller, we should be able to see it's going to play through. And the video will get stuck around about. So as soon as I like hover over this black bar, when the video got stuck. Yeah, there it is. So the video just got stuck, and the rest of it is all black frames. Black. Um, yeah, just black frames. Let's try that. But yeah, look, at least I could save the clip.